Are you looking for the best large screen tablets? In this video we will look at some of the best large screen tablets. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. Apple iPad Pro 13. Apple's 2024 iPad Pro lineup is by far the most capable and impressive iPad lineup we've seen, making it our best overall pick. It's also the most expensive by a long shot. The design is much slimmer than previous Pro models, and you'll find Apple's powerful M4 processor. This chip consists of a new 10-core GPU, next-generation machine learning accelerators to handle a diverse range of tasks, and promotion technology, enabling variable screen refresh rates ranging from 10 to 120 Hz. Znet Reviews Editor, Carrie Wan, spent some time with the 13-inch Apple iPad Pro and was especially impressed by the new Tandem OLED screen. In practice, Tandem OLED makes the iPad Pro a phenomenal tablet for visual experiences. I've been able to complete text-heavy and photo editing work which often require adequate viewing angles under a New York City sun that thinks it's already summer, one wrote in his review. Watching Netflix and Disney Plus on the iPad is straight-eye candy, colors pop, and the darker, moodier scenes have a level of shadow detail unseen on older Pro models. The Pro also supports the new Apple Pencil Pro, which has range of features including a squeeze gesture for quick tool, color, and other changes, a gyroscope for precise control of pens and brush tools with a simple rotation, and custom haptic feedback that you can feel via a pulse. It also pairs with the newly revamped Magic Keyboard which is thinner and lighter, has a larger trackpad, and a new row of function keys this year make the keyboard case more essential than ever for the full iPad experience. Number 2. Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 FA if you want to spend less on a big tablet, Samsung's FE series of devices are designed with Samsung fans in mind. That is, the company takes the best features of its high-end devices, trims some of them down, and releases a more affordable product. The Tab S7 FE has a large 12.4-inch display, a snappy processor, as well as multiple storage and memory options. The device, which comes in various colors, also has a 5G version available if you want to use it while on the go. Some standout features include face recognition technology, two stereo speakers with Dolby Atmos, and multi-device connectivity. It also has a great battery life that will last you for at least 12 hours. While the display on the S7 FA isn't as nice as the S8 Ultra, Amazon customers say it's still more than suitable for streaming or playing games, and it also comes with an S Pen, adding even more to its affordability. Outstanding vividness with 27.81 cm, 11-inch, dynamic AMOLED 2X display, 120Hz refresh rate, 2560x1600, WQXGA. Powerful Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chip with 8-core CPU. 13MP rear camera, 12MP ultra-wide front camera, quad speakers by AKG. 8400mAh battery, dual-SIM PSAM plus eSIM S Pen with bi-directional charging, inbox. Number 3. Microsoft Surface Pro 9. Microsoft's Surface lineup helped usher in the two-in-one detachable computer market, so I'd be remiss if I didn't include it on this list. 97% of Best Buy customers who have purchased this tablet would recommend others buying it, giving it an overall rating of 4.8 out of 5. With the Surface Pro 9, you're getting a tablet that runs Windows 11 out of the box, instead of a mobile operating system like Android or iPadOS. That means you're not going to have to worry about finding apps or workarounds for your workflows. Znet Senior Reviews Editor, June Wan, went hands-on with the Surface Pro 9, calling it, the MacBook competitor Windows users have been waiting for, calling out one issue with the tablet. That keyboard, along with the Surface Slim Pen 2, is sold separately but is quintessential to achieving the optimal Surface Pro experience, Wan wrote. The Surface line has built quite the reputation with this 2-in-1 form factor so my disappointment with Microsoft for not bundling the keyboard at least remains a thing. If you want to use the Surface Pro 9 as a laptop you'll need to buy a Surface Pro Signature keyboard. Or, you can opt to get the bundle that includes the keyboard and Microsoft Slim Pen 2 stylus, but you'll be shelling out $280. 2.4 Pixel Sense touchscreen, ultralight and ultra-portable at just 1.13 kilograms. Get more done on a full-size keyboard with fast, fluid key travel. Plug in the accessories you use today with built-in USB-C and USB-A ports, Surface Connect, and headphone jack. 
Number 4. Microsoft Surface Pro X. I already included the Surface Pro 9 on this list, but the Surface Pro X deserves its own callout. The Pro 9 and Pro X share the same design along with keyboard and stylus support. What makes the Pro X different is that it's powered by Microsoft's SQ1 or SQ2 ARM-based processor. That's the same kind of processor architecture that's used by Apple in its Apple Silicon chips currently found in the iPad Pro and several Macs. The benefits of moving to an ARM processor are seen in battery life and, in the case of the Pro X at least, the addition of LTE connectivity. However, there are some downsides. One of which is that apps need to be rebuilt to support ARM processors, instead of the tried-and-true Intel or AMD processors Microsoft uses in the rest of its Surface products. Znet contributor Simon Bisson also used the Surface Pro X and said, Microsoft has produced an excellent device for mobile workers, with a focus on Office and the web. Verified customers say that if you want a tablet that has LTE connectivity so that you can work from anywhere, the Pro X is worth considering. Microsoft Surface Pro 9 5G, 13-inch touchscreen, Microsoft SQ3, 8GB memory, 256GB SSD, device only, latest, platinum, supports both, 5G and 4G per LTE. Number 5. Wacom Intuos Pro Large. Wacom is one of the industry leaders when it comes to drawing and graphics tablets. With virtually no lag and 8,192 levels of pressure sensitivity in the included battery-free Wacom Pro Pen, the Wacom Intuos Pro is the best drawing tablet on the market for professional artists. Plus, it has an active surface area of 12.24 by 8.50 inches, which gives you plenty of space to create. The tablet's lightweight design, it weighs 2.86 pounds, makes it easy to use on your desk or lap, and you can customize everything from the tablet's express keys to the Pro Pen 2's buttons, depending on your favorite shortcuts. Reddit users note that the Pro Pen 2 is better than anything they have experienced in a stylus and that it alone is worth buying the Wacom Intuos Pro 4. My experience with this tablet was fairly easy and enjoyable, especially for someone who is not a professional artist. The pen makes it easy to fine-tune details and brush strokes in any drawing program you are working on. Plus, you'll also get free access to drawing-specific apps and services, like Clip Studio Paint Pro for two years, Boris Optics for one year, and Corel Painter Essentials 8 and Corel Aftershot Pro 3 for 90 days. 4096 Pen Pressure Sensitivity Battery-free pen using EMR, Electromagnetic Resonance, Technology plus or minus 0.25 millimeters digital tolerance in accuracy.